Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to understand about the LT spy simulation of relaxation oscillator. Okay. So you can see here this is the circuit of relaxation oscillator. Okay. So so I will show you in the simulation how the circuit works and what is the startup condition, right? So let me let me show you the application of this relaxation oscillator. Okay. So what is the application of relaxation oscillator? You can see here. So applications of relaxation oscillator that is it is used in the signal generators. It is used in counters, memory circuits, voltage controlled oscillators that is VCO. It is also used in gaming and fun circuits. It is also used in oscill as a oscillators. It is used in multi vibrators. So these are the basic application of this relaxation oscillator. So this is very common question you might have asked in universities like what is the working of relaxation oscillator and what is application of relaxation oscillator, right? So now let us go back to our circuit. So this is our circuit diagram, right? This is our circuit diagram you can see here. So basically I have used here LT, LT1001, right? So if you see here, this is the op amp LT1001 and it has dual supply that is 15 plus 15 volt and minus 15 volt you can see here this is plus 15 volt and this is minus 15 volt and minus terminal of this op amp is connected via a capacitor which is connected to the ground and other end is connected to a resistance which is connected to the output of this op amp and Plus, you can see here the feedback is connected to the output feedback is connected to R3 and R2 and it is connected to the plus terminal of an open. This is dual supply. This is plus 15 volt and this is minus 15 volt. And let us run the simulation now. So go at this button. This is run button and edit simulation command. You can see I've selected this transient analysis and stop time is 5 millisecond, right? And I've also checked enable the startup condition. So I check this here. So your, your command is like dot transient 5 millisecond and it all it will also show you how this circuit behaves at the startup, right? So let's directly run the simulation now. Run the simulation and you can do here. You can see here this is this is the output of this is the output of your relaxation oscillator, right? This is the output of your relaxation oscillator. So what you can do here, you can have a look on different window. So this is this window is for only the circuit and this is for the waveform. And if you, you can see here, this is the startup condition of oscillator where, where what is happening here? What is happening here? Your output voltage is trying to swing from positive voltage to negative voltage. So this is the first swing and this is the second swing. And at the third swing, you can see your oscillator is now stable. It has got stable amplitude for both positive polarity and the negative polarity. Okay. So it has got the stable amplitude. And if you want to zoom it further and let's say if you want to find out the frequency for this oscillator you may find by using two cursor so here i have got let's say put cursor one here okay and let us put the cursor two here right so if you are if you want to have a look of the frequency how much it is so you can see you can see the frequency for this oscillator is 4 kilohertz right the frequency for this oscillator is is 4 kilohertz right right guys your cursor 2 is here and your cursor 1 is here and you can see here the frequency is around 
four kilohertz. Okay, so so guys, hope you you have understood the simulation of a relaxation oscillator. How you can draw your circuit in LT spice? How you can simulate the circuit? How you you can write your command, startup command, and transient command in LT spice? And what is the application of relaxation oscillator? If you have any further question, feel free to ask me in comment section. Thanks for watching this video, guys.